Why do depressed people eat chocolate? We know that some of us have an increased consumption of chocolate, especially during times of sadness or stress. Numerous studies have been conducted on this topic and opinions have been expressed. What is chocolate? Will it make us happy? What are the psychological repercussions? Psychiatry specialist, Dr. Chibra Erdogan provided information on the matter. Chocolate contains powerful antioxidants from cocoa, carbohydrates, high amounts of vegetable protein, potassium, magnesium, vitamins B1, B2, D, E, riboflavin and caffeine. We can say that most of these substances are beneficial for our health. Chocolate contains psychoactive ingredients that make people enjoy it. Some studies have proven the effect of chocolate on hormones and its relationship to happiness. Studies on this topic show that the bioactive nutritional components phenylethylamine and magnesium in cocoa content provide the release of natural substances such as serotonin, dopamine and endogenous opioids in the body. There are those who remember that chocolate, considered God's food in ancient times and said to have been consumed for healing purposes in many historical sources, was once sold in pharmacies. At this point, it is very important to find the right size and not to miss the dose in chocolate, as in everything else. The ideal size is 20 grams per day. The healthiest option is the one with more cocoa. Bitterness bitter is chocolate. In a study conducted by British scientists with 13,000 people, the effect of dark chocolate on mental health was examined and showed that those who ate dark chocolate had a 58% lower risk of developing depression than those who did not. It is important to emphasize that it is important to prefer dark varieties that contain at least 70% cocoa in chocolate. Chocolate and depression This relationship is generally seen in some individuals with depression or mental disorder. Conversely, some people consume less food, including chocolate. There could be many reasons for this difference. Our personal development could be related to life events in the oral period, or it could be explained by eating disorders called emotional eating. Studies have focused on cocoa. It is the amount of sugar to be taken into account here. In other words, a few bars of dark chocolate may be good for our mood but as we eat more, the needle is tipping over due to high calories, weight issues, and unhealthy storage of sugar. For this reason, it would be beneficial for us to content ourselves with some dark chocolate and some happiness.